What is going on, y'all? Travis here, back with another episode of Grey's Anatomy Season 8, Episode 13. Let's get into it, shall we? The baby you have is the baby you were destined to have. It was meant to be. That's what all the adoption people tell you. Anyway, I like to think it's true. But everything else in the world seems so completely random. What if one little thing I said or did Those could have made it all fall up. apart? Y'all two could get a divorce. Stop. What if I'd chosen another life for myself or another person? We might have never found each other. Cuties. Cuties. What if I'd been raised differently? What if my mother had never been sick? What if I'd actually had a good father? What if? What if? What if? Meredith! 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 Good morning, Mom. Oh! Are you riding with me or with your father? Don't wait, I'll go with Dad. Who's coming with me? Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, darling. Hey. Don't be late, either of you. Sets a bad example. We got a dream at the, 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 is the, up the. <laughs> so we still got everybody here. Addison! <laughs> Was she pregnant? A pregnant Addison? Okay. All right. I need you to sit right here and wait until mommy comes out, okay? Play with your thingy. No, mommy! Yes, sit right there. Hey, pumpkin. Hey, Daddy. Hey, really? I mean, you couldn't be uh, anything wait. else? Well, what? She's going to schedule a staff what? meeting before the daycare opens. What do you expect me to do? She's here. Hi, guys. Wait. I've been looking at Seattle Press's Wait, numbers, what? and I think we can absorb them the way we did Mercy West. Congratulations on your third Harper Avery Award. Portal vein reconstruction. Pretty soon they're going to rename the Whipple the Gray. There's some press here today, FYI. Trauma. Uh, abdominal closure on an MVC, and we will wait to see what comes in. Neuro. I have a laminectomy. Got a golf game? <laughs> you know what, people? If you're not innovating, be generating. Cardio. Yang is doing a solo thoracic aortic aneurysm. Also, I'll be checking in on my kid with the artificial lung. Wait, uh, yeah, she's cardio? Can I just cardio? say for the record that he's my patient, and I don't agree with this method of treatment? I got emergency approval. It buys the kid more time. It keeps him from she being looks sedated gorgeous. and ventilated. Why? He should be sedated. Let his body heal. This is just too risky. Innovative. Shepard, this is what I'm talking about. Good work, Torres. General Dr. Bailey. Yes, uh, extended Whipple. Speak up. I'm doing an extended Whipple. <laughs> Dr. Bailey, go on. Advanced pancreatic cancer with invasion of the portal vein. Well, what are you using to graft the portal vein? Um, the jugular. I'll take that. Excuse me? I'll take your Whipple. Send me the chart ASAP. I neonatal. Uh, pyloric stenosis. Ah. Actually, two pylorics and... That's not a reflection on you, but she probably wants a surgeon to take a mind off all of it. Harper Avery fuss. This version of, so of Bailey... Oh my god! When? Last night. I mean, I kind of thought he would, and then sure enough. Are you okay? Because I know it's going to be hard for too. you, but you are going to find someone, April. Oh, still is really there, cool. yes. Oh, I know. Charles is. Hi. Hey, April. Charles is what? Nothing. Alive? Have you told anyone else? That's my parents? No, you're my person. This is so what? beautiful. You guys, you're going to be like the next shepherds. Through that, we're going to be the next whoever. <laughs> okay, tell me everything. Last night, we went out to dinner. Good morning. Are you talking to me? Jackson, don't feed the animals. Every single one of you could suck. Hey, how's everybody doing this morning? Everybody ready to kick some butt? Kick some butt? It's around the board, guys. Avery, covered in the pit. Yay. What so a nerd. Rosa, okay, you're already getting yours. But I'm, I'm kind of yeah. into it. Well, I guess that means I'm doing <laughs> tourist post stops. Captain? Uh, I'm on shepherd service. Good shepherd. Hey, I'm on bad shepherd. Maybe we're going to be the next shepherds. No, we aren't. The day's as good as you made. Let's get out there and keep Seattle Grace the country's best hospital. Come on! Yang, smile. Let's move. Uh, can I speak with you, Dr. Weber? Karev. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. I thought we had a rule about this in the hospital. Oh God, I mean, I'm not so bad, bad at it, because Karev kind of looks like a snack. Don't I? What else? Well, what would your parents think? I mean, what'd your mom say? Oh, well, she loved it, of I'm course. I'm kind of into it. She adores you. Finally. I just, it took a while. I don't... Well, you were a jerk before you met me. She didn't know there was a good guy in but I did. Oh, I love it. And I love you. Have a great day. Come on, guys. Let's go. Are these two? You're so good with the kids. <laughs> How's he doing? He's better. Yeah, I think we're past it. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's great. Mm -hmm. I know. I just heard it can be a hard road coming back. I mean, who knows what he went through over there. He doesn't like to talk to me about it, but she he does Skype with some so of his old hot. buddies that are still in Iraq. And this guy, Teddy, seems to be helping him through it. And he hasn't had another episode since. So anyway, he's good. This guy, he's Teddy. Good. Good now. I don't know how you do it. And then with the kids, too. You'll find out soon enough, right? <laughs> Besides, you and Derek will be fine. 
You two are perfect. She wants you to use your full potential. Where's Mark Sloan? Hi, honey. Hi. Like that clinical trial you used to talk about. I'm about to have a child, Richard. I don't have time for a clinical trial. I think you should find it. I think it'll do you good. Good morning. Mm. Clinical this trial. elevator's not working. What an ass. So I brought you a coke hit found in an ass. Overdose, tried Narcan. Had a shot for once in the field at 300. Right, on my count. One. Refab, charge the panels at 300. There. There we go. One, two, three. It reaches all yours. A talk screen, an EKG, a CBC. What the fuck? Well, it's a stroke of luck. I'm doing a surgery today, and I'm planning to use the new gray technique. Rather than a boring press interview, why don't you come on up to the gallery, take a few shots of the technique in action. We'll talk after. I'll see you in the OR. That was brilliant. Settle for another boring press release, right? So can I scrub in? I would love to see the procedure done firsthand. Your focus is cardio. You're not going to get a cardio fellowship scrubbing in on your mother's whipple. That's true. Christina Yang is doing a solo aortic aneurysm. That came in last night. Had I been here... you were too busy getting engaged. Now that that's over, what do you want to do? Do you want me to ask Dr. Torres to give it to you? No, Mother. I can get it myself. There you go. Dr. Bailey! Ah. I am stoked for our Whipple today. Are you stoked? We, uh... Um, stoked. You gotta speak up. We're not doing a Whipple today. I had it taken from me. Mandy! You can't let Mandy. people walk all over you. You gotta stand up for yourself. Not if it's Ellis Gray, I don't. Ellis is operating? Come on. The next best thing to operating is watching Ellis Gray do it. We gotta get in on that surgery, Mandy. Remember what we say? I don't remember what we say. We create. Oh, we create our own destiny. Our own destiny. Come on. Who are these people? Hi there. Oh, God. Now? You OD'd, your heart stopped, but you're stable. Can I get a name, I'll please? be stable with you. Anything, really, so we don't mix up your pee with somebody else. You have my pee. Yeah, you were kind of giving it away for a while there. Uh, name? Lucio. Ball. You're a funny lady. That's how I make my living. We are gonna get you worked up and send you on your way. Hey, where am I? Uh, Seattle Grace Hospital. Oh, God. Ah! Teresa, don't push. Ah! Kevner, what's happening? He's dilating in the face. The baby started crowning and then just stopped. Okay, move. Ah! Teresa, you're doing great. Ah! Kevner, order Not a 3D ultrasound. Stat in prep and OR. Ah! Engage my husband. Right away. Ah! What happened? He detached the connector to the artificial lung, and I had to clamp off the cannula. I told you this was a bad idea. Hook an OR. Let's get it hooked back up. It's too dangerous. He has to go back on ECMO. Hey, hold on, everybody stop. Look at his set. 93. He's never been above 79. His respiratory rate's good. Riley, is it hard for you to breathe at all? No, I can breathe. We're blowing this, OK? Oh, wow. <laughs> breathing better than he should be. He's breathing better than he ever has. He can use it until he gets the transplant? We need to run more tests from the sound of his lungs. It's possible he may not even need a <laughs> transplant. Are you serious? Uh, well, you know, we have Are to. You we serious? have to see the test. Oh, but... thanks. I love you. I love you. Oh, You're I think I do too. <laughs> Wait. Why can't you do the surgery? Chief of surgery. My we'll brain is the... like malfunctioning. <laughs> no, I mean, I can't. I'm I like, would. she just. What the fuck? Protocols and. Think of it as a huge upgrade. You just got handed the keys to a Jaguar and you've been driving Civic. Dr. Gray. Hello, Alex. Alex. I'm Dr. Gray. I'll be doing your pancreatic o Did this motherfucker just call Miranda Bailey a Civic? Your internal iliac vein. By forgoing the use of the jugular, you'll have no visible scarring on the neck. It's nice. I'll gladly have you sign these consent forms. Pleasure to meet you. I'll see you after we're done. Good talk. Any chance I could scrub in with you. Alex, of course. Love to have you. See, you have to speak up for yourself. Can you explain anything that woman just said? You know, excuse me. Here you go, sir. Your heart stopped again. Because of all the cocaine you've enjoyed, you're going to need an AICD pacemaker. If you have any questions about this procedure, here's an informative brochure. She's a ray of sunshine. She is. I'm gonna assume that you don't have an insurance. Is there somebody maybe I can call? Parents, somebody? Mm, parents are dead. They're from disease, family history? My mother died of a stomach thing. My father killed himself. I am really sorry. Thatcher? What's, what's funny? I do have a sister. She's a half-sister. Okay. Nearby? Very. She's a doctor. Are you kidding? Who? Who? Who is she? Hey, we've never met. She doesn't know me. And trust me, she doesn't want to. God. Yeah, have a look at her ultrasound. That is a massive tumor. What? Shut up. Pressing up against the neck is the only secure. Why can't I see my baby, oh. Teresa? Your baby has a tumor. Dr. Shepard's here. He's going to take good care of her. What? Wait, what's wrong with her?
Damn. What's sad? So long. I wasn't standing around. I had to make sure that the mother wouldn't bleed I out. Any longer she wouldn't be a mother. I need to make sure the airway is secure. The leaders can't wait. You have to work on the neck as I operate. It's going to take us all day. I'm planning on spending the day with your wife. We'll see you in there. It's a beautiful day to save lives. Nice. Oh, hey, doll. Hey. What's up? I have to steal a surgery from Christina Yang. Yang's always stealing surgeries. The girl gives them the creeps. I know. It's the just... creeps? Mom's operating today, and I thought it would be nice to go in and see it, but she doesn't want me in there. So... Remember when you were learning how to ride a bike and you ran into the back of Richmond Station Wagon? What happened after that? You made me get back on my bike. No, your mother made you get back on, and you learned to ride a bike. She just wants you to succeed. I know. I'm doing a proctocolectomy right now. You want in? Single incision? Probably shouldn't. Probably not. This hair. Any aortic aneurysms has she actually done? Two. In the hospital. She's probably done more at home on a patch. <laughs> you guys she are with anyone ever? No. That's what happens to you when you screw in attending. You're a pariah. I'm like your approach to just never having sex with anybody. No, Virgin Jones. Thank you. Her and Preston Burke. And apparently it was so scary for him, he actually had to leave the state. I always say never mess with the crazy chicks. She's probably going to go full on Izzy one day and shoot up the hospital. What's Izzy? She was a girl in our class who was sleeping with a patient. And then she stole a transplant heart for him. Until Meredith turned her into her mom and got her fired. Oh, my God, Mary, you're so brave. Hold on a second. How many people washed out your year? Two. Herman O'Malley, 007. He uh, failed his intern exam and was never seen again. OK, here I go. Where are you going? Let's get back on my bicycle. Ah. Dr. Gray's going to graft an iliac vein to the portal vein. The man's got some femorals and the iliacs won't be useful. I mean, she's going to look first. Who's that woman with Dr. Robbins? Ortho surgeon? Oh, that's <laughs> so much more sense. Should have gone into ortho. I liked ortho. Why didn't you? When Alice Gray says you're good for cardio. Oh. I was wondering if I could do the aortic aneurysm today. This will be Yang's third, so it's only fair. Weber, I know how many you've done, and I know what my residents need. My mother suggested that I ask you. Why don't you split it? You and Yang can uh, do it together. Whatever Alice Gray wants. You know it. Yang's not going to like it. It's better than kicking her off the case. It scares me. A Lucy, you got some planning to do. I'm just gonna go. If you don't get this procedure, you're going to die. Look, I get it. I know it is scary. But I can tell you everything that's gonna happen. Okay. The automatic implanted cardioverter defibrillator is placed beneath the skin below the collarbone. Yeah, I have a photographic memory. Yeah, okay, well, you should go to med school. Right, or I could be a ballerina. I'm serious. You should see all of this as a second chance. People turn things around all the time. You're smart. You're sharp, you're beautiful. You got a sister here you never even met. You could have a whole new family. Start by fixing your heart, OK? OK. Oh, all right. It's going to be OK. Are you eating the banana you operated on? Meredith Weber. Is Meredith Weber doing all my aortic aneurysm? Ah! Ah! <laughs> if you tell Meredith or Ellis, anyone. That surgery is mine. I will fix it so you never see the inside of an OR again. Barry! I'm not sharing my surgery. Change the board again. Look, I didn't change the board. Torres did. Where's Torres, then? CSF is leaking. Let's get some suction in there first. I need you to have lunch with the president of the board of the Bryson School. Why are we talking about this? Because night? you're never home. You're always spending the night in that stupid trailer and that stupid piece of land. The socks is dropping. What did you do? I didn't do anything. Okay, the airway. We're losing I'm working as hard as I can. Just pay attention to what you're doing. Do me a favor. Going into surgery. Tell Dr. Gray that the patient has a history of DVT and that the iliac veins may not be suitable for graft. Why didn't you say something? You're going in there. Just tell her. It was your patient. I'm not going to tell her she's wrong. She took the chart. She read it, right? Yes. She knows what she's doing. Well, just tell her. This version of Miranda. Yeah, I don't. When in the hell are you going to give Lucy I a just, Mallory ICD? I don't. You have to I do can't. that surgery. I don't think so. You did the consult. I have a surgery. You're the cardio consult. You do it. Avery can do it. I'm not giving up the surgery to stick a pacemaker in a junkie. Tell your wife to have Meredith Webb. Again? Jesus. I'm sorry. I just got really. You won't need stitches this time. What? I thought it was supposed to be getting better. Call or are you going to hit another the intern? That that no. <laughs> Why do you keep helping me? Why don't you just report me? Literally, the other 20 people could report you. Because I'm a doctor? I just saw that. Please don't tell my wife. Nobody else will. Well, we can finish the rest of this. What are you talking surgery. about? Suction here. So June sounds good. Have you thought about where? M Meredith and I thought about Hawaii. That might be cool. You know, have everyone come out. And... Really? A destination wedding? I'm running a hospital. I can't just dash off to retract that, please. You'll do it here. I'll book the Rainier Club. It's gorgeous. That sounds great. What the hell am I looking at? Iliac veins. 
are completely thrombosed. Unusable, completely unusable. Did you know about this? No. Change of plans. We'll use the renal vein. Someone page Dr. Bailey. I want her in here now. Why aren't you doing a T-bar? T-bar is safer. It's far less invasive. You don't have to crack the chest. I already ordered the graft. You might have worked out your surgical plan before this. It did. And my surgical plan didn't include this Nimrod. Included hacking up the patient like a psycho. Girls, don't make me come over there and do it myself. Shut up and work. Ten blade. Avery. I'm um, booking an OR. I'm gonna take my that girl up for a pacemaker. Somebody made off with an armload of drugs from the dispensary. Okay. Why? Because the dispensary was accessed with your ID card. That's why. Damn it. But you knew the patient had thrombosis. I, I did. I, Speak up. In the legs, yes. Did you look at his chart? Of course I looked at his chart. Why wasn't it in his chart? I had chosen to use the jugular. They were in the medical records. And you didn't tell me? Because I'd opted to not cut the man's throat? Good But plan. I ended up cutting his throat anyway. My procedure's a wash. That's why I picked jugular. Is that right? Is that why you picked it? Alex, where's my graft? Throw Alex under the bus. What the fuck? Just suturing. Whoa. Squirter. I might have nicked the carotid. The people are trying to kill me. Did you get the whole tumor? I'm asking what I should tell the mother. I will talk to her myself. So we'll talk about the preschool. It's going to be late. I'm going to stay and look into this clinical trial. One more reason for you to stay out of the house. It's fine. Maybe you'll be more interested once the baby comes. Right. Everything's going to be different when the baby comes. Well, a girl can hope. It's going to change. What do you think is going to change? Did you even want a baby? I'm not I want a baby. No, I'm not talking about a baby. This baby. With me. Do you love me? No. Do you? Of course I love you. Y'all's relationship Can you say it without looking at the floor? Less than three minutes. Go over that and the organs start dying. It's taking so long. I took the time it needed. Two minutes. Done. Go back on bypass. Yes, sir. Oh, got a leak. Okay, I'll find it. I'll throw a stitch. No, it's behind the heart. You need to do an internal graft. Will you shut up? Dr. Torres. Weber's right. Yang. We're way safer. Let her do it. Five-o prolink. Move your hands. Move your hands, please. Oh. What are you doing? I got it. I found the leak. Uh, give me a clamp. Two-o prolink. I got it. Have you seen my wife? As a matter of fact, I have. She just threatened to quit. Do me a favor, wash your laundry at home, not in my OR. There's two sides to every story. Yeah, I'm not interested in that. Uh, Richard and I had very high hopes for you, but you have been nothing but a disappointment. The residents have a nickname for you, and it is not flattering. What do they call it? Get me? it together, because if it comes down to a choice, you need to be very clear which one of you I will choose. So I start to do the repair. And she just stuck her hand in. Yes! But what happened? Oh, Yang's a freaking maniac. She's dangerous. My patient's fine, awake, great vitals. Well, that's great, because OD girl bolted. You had no business shoving in there. You had no business in that OR. Dr. Torres specific. Dr. Torres only sided with you because you're the chief's little girl. Well, we'd all be working under Dr. Preston Burke right now, but you screwed us out of that opportunity, oh. literally. He let the state to get away from you. Why don't you ask Prince Charming what he and the Virgin Mary like to do in his office? What are you talking about? What? She's what, lunatic. What, what is she talking about? You can't believe a word she says. Come on. April. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, God. Oh, just shoot me now. No! Why do you have to say that? Tests are good. He's breathing unassisted. He's gonna be home by the end of the week. He's been taken off the transport list. Yep. Two weeks on your little thing. <gasps> His lungs are actually improved. <laughs> well, good work. Oh, amazing work. I didn't even want to do it. <laughs> it was amazing. You're amazing. Well, we should celebrate sometime. Yeah, we should. We should go get drinks. This is one to celebrate. Here are your kids. <gasps> Mommy! Oh, hi, baby girl. Okay, well, sometime. Yeah, yeah, sometime. All right, here we go. Slow down. Don't tell me. I can't, I can't believe them. I cannot believe them. I heard what happened. You did? Yes, and you should be upset. You should be humiliated. You don't let Yang, you don't let anyone show you up in your OR. Understand? Ever. I shouldn't have been in there. Then why in the world did you go in? You pushed me. And you aren't mad because I embarrassed myself. You're mad because I embarrassed you. <clears throat> Alice, what in the hell is wrong? I want you to fire Mandy Bailey tonight. I want you what to do it. What are you talking about? What is this She about? made a complete fool of me. I have no idea. I look like a total failure. I'm like, just hold on. Just breathe. <laughs> I was humiliated in front of all those people trying to fix her stupid mistake. I look like a fool. You know you're not. <laughs> there was nothing to grab. You, you made it work. You always do. The patient is fine. <laughs> you can't control everything. I know you want to, but you can. Uh, is Meredith all right? I don't know how to talk to her. Richard, will you talk to her? Yeah, I will. I will. She'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs>
I am horrible at it. I am terrible. Oh, I just want her to do well. I just want her to do the best she can. I, I know. And she'll be okay, okay? No problem. Thank you. Could you imagine if shit really went down like this? Yeah. Thanks for today. Tell your wife. Get some help. She'll leave, and I'll lose my kids. She, she's, she's afraid I'm going to hurt one of them. Aren't you? Hey. Hey! How are you? Oh, my gosh. What happened to your hand? Oh, oh, I... Uh, some junkie patient knocked me into a tray of instruments. Oh, you poor baby. All right, let's get you home. Okay, let's Come go. On. Come on, let's go. go. All right. Weird. Help. She was just lying in the street. I almost ran her over. We've got this. Closest VTAC. Where's the crash car? Doctor. Yeah, we're all doctors, all right? Now move. Clear. You don't even Turn work 300. there? Clear. Attack. We got her. You know, I can find so Dr. Shepard. Which one? <laughs> Meredith. No, Dad. Don't come and clean up after her again. You do it every time, and it's beneath you, and it's pointless. I can't do anything right for her, Doesn't and I finally figured out why. She wants everyone to be ordinary so she can be extraordinary. She wants everyone small. Oh, just stop it. And that's what she's done to you. Ooh. She has made you small, and I'm not going to let her do it to me. I don't know what's wrong with me. All I know is that the baby is coming, and I want it. It may change things. You could have her. We'll just take it one step at a time. I want to make it work. It isn't your baby. It's stupid. I know. Brand new shirt, and now it's got junky blood all over it. Oh, this is awkward. Clear. Got a rhythm? Barely, but damn it, it's gone. Done the damn surgery. A systole, uh, give her one amp of atropine. Okay, it's not healthy. Another, an amp of epis. Go! Move. Let's crack her chest. She OD. Okay, so she's gonna die anyway. What has she got to lose? Chest rest. Here you go. Okay, let's do it. Hey, did I? Template. On it. Are you crying? <laughs> Little Bandy Bailey. I screwed up. I had a good thing. I had a chance to be better. And I screwed it up. What the hell is wrong with me? I just lost my job. Do you see me crying? I have no earthly idea what to do next, but am I hiding in an elevator? Whimpering about it. No, because what do we say, Alex? What do we say? We create our, our own destiny. destiny. Uh-huh. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. You should, too. Guys, you lost her. Shut up. One more amp of Effie. Charging. Charge. Clear. Charge 30. Ready? Go. Clear. Status check. Wait, wait. Your life is a gift. Accept it. She's back. Okay, we got her. We got her. No matter how screwed up or painful okay. it seems to be. Okay, now what do I do? Okay, lick it, slam it. Come on. Fast, 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 fast. Okay, that's good. But we don't have to do that thing where I say something and then you say something and then someone cries and women or whatever. Oh, yeah. Good. It's just that nothing is turning out the way I thought it would. It's like I don't even recognize my own life. I know what you mean. Some things are going to work out as if they were destined to happen. Get some sleep. You gotta get some sleep. You look like crap. I look better than you. Not possible. Your mother says the residents have a name for me. I wouldn't know anything about that. What is it? What are they calling? Come on. McDreary. We McDreary. call you McDreary. You think that's funny? It's apt. McDreary. That's my life. So how about tonight you're not McDreary, you're just... You're just a guy in a bar. And you're just a girl in a bar. I am. And I drink to kill Tom. Here you go. Cheers. As if they were just meant to be. Weird. Weird. Weird, but I love it. That was super interesting. I mean, I'm a firm believer in destiny, and, and if things are meant to be, they will be. So it's interesting to see some of those storylines, how some things still happened, even though it was quite a bit different. Sloan and, and Addison, and how some people were still around, even though they shouldn't have been anymore. Like, what's his face that got shot? how different some people were like it's just wild to think about like how different things could be but how some things still happen to work out the way that they should very interesting to see these people like jump into different parts of their characters like different personality traits and stuff that was a fun episode to see and a creative way to get some people back that have been gone or that have died or or whatever <laughs> that was kind of a mind fuck but in a good way i dig that let me know what y'all thought about it though and i'll see you on the next one Bye.